Cooking up some bacon. Whammy! Got yourself a bacon sandwich. Safety first. <laughs> Every time I make a sound, Diesel thinks that someone's here. I knew at that time it was you, man. You can't get me like that. You're a good guard dog, Diesel. Like, he's a good alarm system. He lets us know right away whenever he hears something. But you sort of gotta turn down the sensitivity, man. Like, turn down the alarm sensitivity. It's a little too, too quick. He likes to jump the gun. He always wants to be the first one to notice that somebody's here, right? And, a lot of false alarms, man, I'm just saying. A lot of false alarms. Cooking up some bacon. I was gonna have bacon and eggs. Had everything ready. But apparently, all of the eggs that we bought for everybody, like we, we bought a ton of eggs for this week, right? Uh, when everyone was out here. And I thought we still had like 18, like a pack of 18 left at least, plus some. I can't find them anywhere. Did we seriously eat all the eggs? Where did all the eggs go? That was a lot of eggs. I didn't eat that much. I'm so confused. I don't know where all the eggs went. I bought a ton of them. They must have been making eggs when I was gone. Except I, I think I remember once I came back, was it when I came back from the airport from dropping some of them off? They had scrambled eggs. They'd made scrambled eggs and they didn't save me any. Well, sucks, I guess it's just bacon then. I'll make some bread, I guess. Uh, some toast, toast and bacon. Toast and bacon it is. Got no eggs. I hope we at least got bread, Frankie. We we'll usually keep it in here. Oh my. Oh my, is there bread in here? Is there hot dog buns? Bagels, more, just regular bread. Regular bread, that's what I'm looking for. Here, here's this. Uh, light rye bread. Okay, well, I guess it's a light bright red, light bright red kind of day. Light bright red, light bright red. All right, Mr. Toaster, do your thing. See, and then you just put it on there like that and like that. Put that on there like that and whammy! Got yourself a bacon sandwich. Got the tripod here. We're about to go into the garage to get the chainsaw. We're gonna go clear the driveway. You can't forget your eye protection when you're using a chainsaw. I'm gonna have to tighten this up a little bit, but it's the only eye protection I could find. It'll work. Never mind then. Guess that won't work. That's too bad. I'll have to find something else. Or I can just wear the whole helmet and it fits just fine. Safety first. This is what we're looking at here. Where did this guy fall off from here? Block the driveway. So, look at that. It fell off from the pretty high up too, eh? Yikes. So my mission for right now is to get this thing all cut up and then I'll bring the pickup over here. We'll load it all in the pickup and then find a spot for it. What I do is I take off all the limbs first. I don't know how you guys cut wood. I'm assuming it's all pretty generally the same. You take off all the limbs first, you just got pretty much the trunk, and then you separate the trunk or the trunk into uh, two feet logs or whatever. Probably about a foot so they can fit in our wood stove. And then we'll chop them up later into smaller pieces. But so far, so good. Here's what we're left with. I pretty much cleared all the branches and whatnot from the trunk. Gonna cut that into even sections, load it up on the pickup and take it to the house. And then I'll deal with all the smaller stuff after that. At least the driveway will be clear. I found myself some better eye protection right on to wear the whole helmet. I was beginning to feel a little silly. Good thing you were all here to watch me do that. 
Otherwise, I would have been feeling silly all alone. But uh, what I did want to tell you now is when you're cutting the wood on the ground like that, I'm being very careful not to let the chainsaw touch the ground. That'll dull the blade. Uh, so it is off the ground just a little bit, but that's one thing you got to be aware of to try not to dig your chainsaw into the ground. Not like I'm any professional or anything, but figured I'd just point that out here because it's probably going to be in the comment section. Don't let your chainsaw touch the ground, Chuck the Guy! I know. I, I got, my, got my eye on it. <laughs> <laughs>